A lot of updates have been posted on YouTube about Assassin's Creed Mirage, but I bet the crucial info in this short video has been left out by all. In this video, we have gathered 7 new crucial updates and latest confirmations about Assassin's Creed Mirage and details of an exclusive interview of Assassin's Creed Mirage art director John Luxella. I promise you do not want to miss any of these updates and number 2 on the list will definitely be favorite of all and in number 5, there is also a mention of Bayek of Siva. Let's start with Roshan first, as we already know that she is going to be Basim's mentor but did you know that Roshan is voiced by Shore Agdaslu and in an interview she talked about her character in detail. Roshan is going to be in her 50s and she was a Persian slave and she escaped from there and joined the Hidden Ones and became a master assassin at Alamud. And according to the website of Assassin's Creed Mirage, Basim is going to be her first ever apprentice. She initially deems Basim fit to join the Hidden Ones but later she would have her doubts about him and according to the creative director Stefan Boudon, the relationship between Roshan and Basim is like a mentor and student, like we have seen it in the old games. And Roshan is not just going to train him to be an assassin but she will also help him with his mental issues. And here is a spoiler for you, at some point Basim is going to cross the line and that will change everything between them. With 6 more important updates like this, at number 6, let's discuss the Assassin's Creed Mirage modern day setting. In an interview with GameSpot, the art director of Mirage, John Luke Sala revealed that there is no present day setting in the game, other than in the beginning and in the end of the game and that too in an animus and it is not going to be playable it's going to be more like cutscene like we have seen in Assassin's Creed Unity. Now at number 5 let's talk about the hidden ones. Assassin's Creed Mirage narrative director Sarah Bioli said this in an interview that Mirage is going to show the hidden ones as an organization. It will show how they work, how they make plans, how they assassinate etc and this is all going to take place at Alamod. We have already known that Basim is going to spend most of his time at Alamut where he is going to meet other hidden ones with Roshan. According to Stefan Vanon, at Alamut Basim is going to find out about the history of the hidden ones and especially he is going to know what happened to Bayek of Seva. In another interview, the art director John Luke Sala said that in Assassin's Creed Mirage, Alamut is going under construction and when it's completed, the hidden ones are going to talk about coming out of shadows and reveal themselves as an assassin organization. And we have seen this in Assassin's Creed 1 that how they do it under the leadership of Hassan ibn Saba. In our earlier video, we have talked about how Basim is going to meet Ali bin Muhammad, a popular historical figure and the leader of Zand Rebellion. Adding more in this, at number 4, there are going to be other famous historical historical characters in the game. Some of the confirmed ones are going to be the Banu Musa brothers, who lived in Baghdad in the time of Zand Rebellion. Musa brothers were famous for their advanced machines, expertise in mathematics, astronomy and whatnot. And Stefan Bodon confirmed that they are going to help Basim in order to upgrade his weapons and tools. At number 3, as promised, let's discuss the special interview of Assassin's Creed Mirage art director John Luke Sala. Unfortunately, we cannot play that recording here because of copyright issues. But we will leave the link of the original video of Access of Animus in the description and you can watch that video after this. And also please like this video, this encourages us to make more videos like this. So in that interview, John Luke Sala said that he is not allowed to talk about the hidden characters but still he revealed that one of them is going to be a female character and she is on a bad side. So yeah, yeah, there is another female character in the game and according to John Luke Sala, she is going to be as badass as Roshan, like we have seen in the cinematic trailer of Mirage. At number 2, we have the most important update and that is about the Parker. Fabian Solomon was asked by Arab Hardware whether the Parker of Assassin's Creed Mirage is going to be like that of Unity, as it was the best in whole franchise.
He replied by saying that this is our absolute goal indeed as we are seriously trying to reach the level of unity in Mirage and we want the players to enjoy Dance Baghdad through parkour, which was and is among the most important pillars that we depended on in development of Mirage, with other two pillars being on the top of our list today. So at number 1, we have an update on the style of assassinations as it will be a great focus point for Assassin's Creed Mirage. The main assassination events will take place in black box missions contained within four districts of Baghdad and we will have the freedom to chart our own path to the target. Assassin's Creed Mirage will introduce brand new animations, upgradable assassin's tools much different from earlier games and the trap setting capacity will also be in Assassin's Creed Mirage gameplay. Mirage will also introduce a new feature which will allow Basim to perform multiple stealth kills at once. That's all for today. We hope you liked our video. Please like, comment and subscribe if you want to be up to date with Assassin's Creed Mirage. See you guys in our next video. Signing off, Game of Facts.